la 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 Hello everybody, so today I'm here to show you how to accurately track biomes in 1.12. So to do this is actually very simple and uses a new 1.12 feature called Advancements. This right here is a quick little setup I have to detect two biomes. It uses two scoreboards, a biome type and a biome test. We use the biome test to detect which biome you are in and then we display it with biome type. So what we're doing here is we're actually using a custom advancement, which was added in Minecraft 1.12. So if we go here, this is the advancement that I created. Right here, I've added the criteria, which is the criteria for this advancement. And I have added several different criteria. So this criteria is named Ocean. It's looking for a trigger, which is a location. So this is triggered on your location. Conditions, X and Z are the min and max of the world so it tracks anywhere in the world and then right here we use the biome tag and biome ocean so i haven't actually added all of the biomes yet but i have added quite a few some of them i couldn't get to work but you can find a list of all the biomes right here time set day you can find a list of all biomes right here on minecraft.gamepd.com dash biome biome ids and you can find all of them so if we come right here, as you can see, Forest Hills has a ID of 18 and Forest has an ID of 4. So if I turn this on, as you can see, it starts saying 18 because I am in a Forest Hills biome. Now if I fly over here towards this lake, which is actually a forest biome, as you can see, I changed into forest biome and now it is displaying 4. So to do this, to do this, it's actually uh, very simple. If we just come back over here and we turn this off, turn it off. Right here, we're just adding uh, all players to have a score of zero so that they're tracked on the scoreboard. Right here, we're setting all players to have a biome type score of negative one. We do this because the score of zero is actually ocean. And then right here, what we're doing is we're doing stats at A. So this is targeting all players. You don't need to execute when using stats. And it's putting the success count onto their biome test. So then if they have a score of biome test min equals one. Oh, well, this is what the command that we're actually testing. We're using advancement test at AC equals one, executing at A. So it's testing for the closest player. And we're testing for biomes and then forest. So what this does is this tests for the custom advancement, which I have right here. I have it in my Minecraft saves biome test, which is the world data advancements and biomes. And it is looking for the forest criteria. So if we come up to the forest, as you can see right here, this is the forest criteria. When I enter a forest biome, I have this criteria. Then we're executing at all players who have a biome test score minimum of one, and we're setting their biome type to four. Then we do it again. We run these stats. Then we run the test for forest hills. Then we set it to, there's nothing here. We set it to 18. And then right here, this is just an execute at all players. And then we revoke the advancement using advancement revoke at A, and then we take away the entire biomes advancement. So this is just a quick little setup, a proof of concept for detecting biomes in Minecraft 1.12. Obviously you need a lot more command blocks to detect all of the advent, uh, all of the biomes using that advancement, and you'd also have to add quite a few more criteria. I will leave links to the criteria below. Hope you enjoyed, and goodbye.